All right, so in this video, I'm gonna be talking about Intel's next generation mainstream processor architecture, Haswell. Haswell will be replacing the current generation Ivy Bridge processors offered by Intel. This means that Haswell will be replacing the Celeron, Pentium, Core i3, Core i5, and mainstream Core i7 lineup. Here are a list of things we currently know about Intel's Haswell architecture. First of all, we know that Haswell will be on a new mainstream socket, LGA1150. This socket will be replacing LGA1155 effectively. We also know that we will only be seeing dual core and quad core variants of the mainstream Haswell architecture. There will be no 6 core or 8 core processors offered on the LGA1150 variants of the Haswell architecture. It's also fairly well known that Haswell will also be on a 22 nanometer process, just like Ivy Bridge. Another similarity that Haswell will have to Ivy Bridge is that it will be using dual channel DDR3. Something new that Haswell will be bringing to the table is integrated voltage regulators, or as many enthusiasts would call them, VRMs. Intel decided to put these on chip to increase power efficiency on the Haswell architecture. Haswell is slated for a quarter two 2013 release. Strong speculation suggests that the release will be in June of 2013. The final thing we know about Haswell is that it will also feature an integrated graphics processing unit just like the current generation Ivy Bridge processors do. However, Intel suggests that the integrated graphics processing unit in Haswell will be two times as powerful as the current generation integrated graphics are. I hope you enjoyed this explanation of Intel's Haswell architecture and uh, I hope you have a wonderful day. Thank you for watching.